What's up, YouTube? Dead Draw here with uh, Colton Brass, also known as Colt Twenty. So, um, we decided to do a new, a new little series where we give you our deck profile of every little tournament we play in, even if it's just a local. Um, it's just to get deck profiles and our show you guys our tech choices uh, and whatnot. So, what were you playing today? I played Infinity. And how'd you do? I went into uh, top four. Awesome. Um, yeah. Okay. All right. Let's get into this deck profile. So I play the uh, standard triple Ashwin. Yep. <clears throat> Just good. Triple Necromancer. I think I'll put it down to two. Not too sure yet, but yeah. Triple Stygian is always good. I'll just keep that. Double Dark Greffer. Work out for you good today? Yeah, it was great. Uh, even if I... I don't know, it's just like pitch the other monster you can't normal summon usually. Yep. That's always good. Summoner Monk. It was just... Uh, I, I just like super happy to see that every time I had. Cause, for like, sure. Definitely consistent. Um, Dynatherium. Just the two. <clears throat> one Armageddon Knight. Oh, really? Only one? Yep. I only played the one. Uh, I thought it was good. Otherwise, it would have been just a little too cloggy. I hated getting two monsters that you were forced to normal summon. All right. Uh, and then one Archfiend Hairs for uh, the field spell, the search. I don't know. It's it's okay. Yep. <clears throat> uh, that's it for monsters. So. Do you know how many that is? I'm not even sure. I think it's fourteen. No, probably sixteen. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm thinking that. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I kind of hit yeah. you with that one. <laughs> All good. Yeah, I, I don't even know how much I have, but whatever. So I've got the one Infernity Launcher, of course. How'd this work out for you today? <laughs> um, I had nothing but the Field Spell on board, top deck this, and I had Graveyard set up. It was <laughs> super broken. <laughs> I love that. That was that was nice. Yeah. The one Foolish Burial, just more consistent. Mind control, really good card. The best card. Yeah, for sure. It was good. Going second, it was just... Except for when you get, like, a do frog. <laughs> oh, yeah, when you mind control do frog. Uh, zero max, I, I just like it. It's a really good card. The one, uh, Palabrinth, of course. I tried two at once before and thought it was bad. Like, I never drew into both at once, but if you do, it's terrible. Yeah. Uh, triple soul charge, Saki. <laughs> So good. <clears throat> Triple up start goblin. Three instant fusion. For sure. Three MST. Go on second. And double rota. Oh, you decided to play two then? Yeah, I played two. It was really good. It's a like, you just it one. Yeah. or play, yeah. Okay. Always good. And then just uh, triple Infernity Break. Yep. So good. And the one Infernity Barrier. That's sure. it for traps. Just four for traps. Like, and it, they prove what. What was the extra deck? So. Double Evolvel Chain. I think three is just too many. Okay. Personally. Yeah. Okay. Double Livier. It's always good. I always felt like I needed to, it just didn't feel that well. Um, the one Evil Swarm X Knight. Never used it at all today, but, you know. It's Arc. Good. Arc. Use it's that good. today? Yep. Yeah, I've used it every couple of times, so every so often. The one Gaga Ga Cowboy for time or whatever. Regna Zero. It's okay. I wouldn't mind, like, taking it out. Oh, really? Yeah. It's like, yeah, it makes all my traps dead. And it's just terrible that way. Abyss Dweller. Uh, number 28, Heartland Draco. Number 80, Rhapsody and Berserk. Master Key Beetle. Good card. Used that so many times today. Black Ship of Corn, so good. Hands. Carbonella Warrior. And uh, Barox for the fusions. I didn't just I didn't go uh, level three. That was just a top deck every now and then. Okay. Yeah. That will use that with the Palabrinth? Yep. Yeah. Palabrinth is just a good banish target for it. 
So yeah. And what's for the side? Um, like what? What do you think your worst matchup? And what do you side most for? Um, sorry. Like, uh, like what? What's your worst matchup? Like, what do you side most for? I side mostly for probably just a mirror match. In all honesty, like that's the only thing I I really dreaded, but like it never happened. For sure, it will <laughs> next week, but whatever. So double vanity's emptiness. Good card. Double traps done. I never used them today. Go on second. Yeah. Double needle ceiling. Good mirror match or whatever. I don't know. That one typhoon. Uh, I thought it was good, especially against the Bujin Bujins or whatever. Um, torrential tribute. Transmigration prophecy. That was good. One light, light imp. Uh, Soul Drain, that came in really handy, and uh, you always got that odd Dark World player. Dark Hole and Dimensional Fissure. For sure. Yeah. I've got these two. Uh, the thing is, I totally forgot to play uh, <laughs> Rank 7 in my extra deck, so I never sided into those. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so next time. If I, sure. if I decide to... It's, it, this is a really good card, XYZ Universe. For sure. Table I mean, turner. It, it could just... It minuses them and oh, pluses yeah. you. So. For sure. Alright, man. Alright. See you later, YouTube. Bye.